Have you ever felt stigmatized for your mental health by another person? Yes, I have been <laughs> um, by people who didn't really understand because I, I used to go to therapy a lot. I used to go to therapy in high school and then I also went in college. I got it a lot more in high school than I did in college, but like every once in a while, like someone would say like an out-of-pocket comment, people would kind of make fun of me for that and be like, oh, you're not all there. Have you ever felt any mental health stigma towards yourself? I would say 100%, yes. Like when I first started going um, to therapy, I was really embarrassed and I actually went to group and I would always lie about where I was going. I would say like, oh, um, you know, I have to go back to my dorm. I'm going to eat dinner by myself. Or like, I'd be telling my friends like all kinds of lies when really it was just group therapy. I didn't tell my parents for a while either. And it wasn't until probably like halfway through group where I realized like, I don't really need to be hiding the fact that I'm going to therapy. Like there's really nothing wrong with it. There are other people who just will deny themselves access to therapy because they're like embarrassed and then I would also like tell myself oh it's fine because it's just group it's not like individual but then I started going to individual therapy too so but yeah I used to rationalize therapy being okay because I was going to group therapy instead of individual therapy I mean obviously my thoughts changed because I did go through the whole process is mental health stigma either from others or from yourself a limiting factor in stopping you from seeking treatment or talking about your mental health? I would say 100% yes, because um, I actually went through like a really tough period where I just felt like completely and totally alone. And people were like telling me that, you know, go get therapy. And I was like, no, I don't want to go get therapy. Like, therapy is for people who can't fix the problems themselves. Like basically, I thought that therapy was for people who were weak, like they couldn't do it themselves. And so I was like denying like going and all this stuff um but then there was like a triggering experience and I called like the crisis hotline and thus I was thrust thrusted into therapy <laughs> but I would say 100% yes like it was a limiting factor in me seeking the help that I needed. Do you ever find yourself stigmatizing others for their mental health issues, whether you'd intentionally like to or not? I definitely have like judgments. I don't know that they're all necessarily negative, but I, I think I definitely like it changes my point of view on like how I interact and how I see that person. Um, I feel like sometimes unintentionally when people say that they go to therapy, I tend to be a little bit more like careful with my words and like how I act around that person. I don't, I don't think it's intentional, but like thinking back on it, I feel like I do kind of change my behavior just slightly. Yes. <laughs> do, you, do you need me to elaborate more or? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay with what I said. Yes. When were you first aware of mental health stigma? So seventh grade I had a friend and she was in therapy because she was suicidal and um I remember thinking like she was so quiet about all of it she was like super super quiet about it all and I remember asking her like oh like, like why are you not telling people about this and she was like well I don't want them to like look at me different and like see me differently and make fun of me and like say that I'm like broken and all this kind of stuff and I feel like that's kind of when I was like, oh, I get that. Because a lot of the guys would be like picking on people, like kind of bullying people for talking about like mental health and all this stuff. So when she did finally say like she was going to therapy, she did get a lot of like flack for that from people around, which was like really disappointing. But I feel like that's probably when I was first aware of like the stigma around mental health. Do you have any ideas for the reduction of mental health stigma? I feel like normalizing it, if you have issues with your mental health, like that should be just as normal as just going to the doctor for like a physical checkup. I feel like encouraging people to talk about it to others and like a lot of bystander action could be helpful too. Like if I do see someone stigmatizing somebody else, then I could be like, hey, stop that that's probably like you don't need to do that to that person so I feel like encouraging like bystander action I feel like 
that would be really good.